Hello everyone, this is Duck 2 welcome to another install tutorial, this time on installing Forge for MultiMC. So uh, we don't really need anything on here, we just need the launcher itself. And uh, if you happen to grab it from MultiMC's website, um, you can do so here, but if you've already got it set up, that's perfectly fine. So just get it from the download section here for whichever operating system you're using, and you'll be good to go. So, once you've got MultiMC set up, you pretty much just go about creating instances. So you just go add instance, or you just right click and then create one. From there you can obviously set up a group if you want to, and so on. Uh, we're going to be doing 116.4 for this video, but pretty much any version should work perfectly fine. Um, so just go a 116.4 forge test, and we'll just do that, and we'll be good, so there's that. And then from there you'll want to go edit instance and then pick your mod loader. So specifically we want to do Forge, not Fabric or Light Loader here. But if you do have it where you want to use Fabric, obviously Forge and Fabric are not compatible, so you can't really do that. And if you want 112 and you want to apply mod uh, Light Loader, you can. Um, so we're just going to do Forge, like so. And uh, we simply just apply that, just at the newest one. We'll open this, which has just got its basic setup here. Pop the mods in that I happen to download, just following here, like so. Which you can easily download on the side, or if you want older versions, you just go to Files, for example, and then just select what you want from here, or go View All, and you'll be perfectly fine to just cycle between stuff, no problem. Um, from there, of course, we pretty much just click on the instance, and it'll get its library files because it needs to get all the stuff for a 116 equivalent version. If there's stuff it doesn't need, obviously it's not going to do that because we'll get the version specific stuff. So just let that do its thing. And uh, yeah, in the meantime, should be good. Um, so yeah, we'll just wait for that to do its thing. We can see the information here of what stage it's on. Shouldn't be much. Progressing as we'd expect, we've got the launcher here in its loading state. Uh, so obviously it'll say, hey, I'm trying to prepare in that Minecraft as well as the mods. And then from there it'll go, okay, I'm actually got all the Minecraft specific information now to, to work out. And then the mods will load in accordingly as well. And then from there we will have a new instance. Ah, okay, I got the, oops. Not the fabric version, I didn't get the correct one. Oh well, should've got that one, but anyway. Oh um, get rid of that, because I don't need it specifically. I just need to have the other. So you'll get certain stuff like that where it doesn't um, work correctly because you got the wrong version. Um, in my case, the fabric one, or probably an older one, or there might be some other reason why it doesn't. Um, there's multitudes of reasons as to why things don't work. Um, but yeah, in that case, it's just I got the wrong file, so I'll just remove that because I'm not desperately in need of it. But uh, yeah, we'll just show um, J I and Bloom and Gloom in this case. But Voxel Map does work. It's just I don't really need it. I showed it in the last tutorial. Just turn off the music, and I'll just set my stuff accordingly real quick. Get rid of that. Set this, and this, and this. This and this and this and this and that's ready to go. Cool. So that's ready. You can view the mods, you can see the GI is installed, we've got that right, that's set up, and that's as per usual. Go here, here, and I'm just gonna set my stuff up, create a new world, and we'll see what happens. We'll just go forge 164 test, and I'll be fine. So yeah. Yep, so this will work for any version, as long as you get the specific mods for whichever versions, you'll be perfectly fine. Um, and as long as you're strict on what version you're using to um, set up the instance, you'll be fine. Um, some versions of mods can carry across, so like some 116 versions, I think, for Forge or even Fabric have carried across. Uh, some 112 maybe, but if it's something like 111, 112, or 112, 116, it's not going to work. So keep that in mind with specific versions of knowing exactly what you need. Um, 
But uh, yeah, we're now in a world. We have GEI here, and we have Bloom and Gloom, our item. So yeah, that is pretty much it. Thanks so much for watching, and goodbye.